Adrian Broner, he returned on the undercard. He beat Carlos Molina. What'd you guys think of Adrian Broner's fight? Easy fight. I thought, I thought, I, I thought, um, I thought Twin Guy uh, put on a great performance. I thought he did, I thought he had a great performance. What did you like about his performance? What did you like about his performance? I mean, I like that he was himself. I like that he was letting his hands go more. He was, you know how you just tweet so strong. He be like, boom, boom. But he was letting his hands go. He was touching uh, Carlos Molina. All right. What do you guys think of Broner? Smarja, you sparred with Broner before, I know, as your, as your brother. What do you think of him? Um, he looked, uh, yes. he looked tremendous against Carlos Molina. And um, he's back. He's at a state. You know, he's, he's, uh, he's a tough he's a hell of a champion. He's, 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 Samarja, Ladaris, you guys, you've both been in the ring with Broner. What makes him such a tough, you know, guy? You know, what, what's his best qualities? Uh, he's, 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 uh, he's a good he's a, time. He's smart. Good. He's, good. Think, He's a well-rounded fighter. I think I think his um his best um quality attribute is that he's physically strong. Like even if, if you look back if you look back on that fight, um you can't even give McDonough a lot of credit for what he did to Bronner because Bronner was a 135 going under 147, and he. He, he he couldn't knock he couldn't knock a 35 pounder out. He couldn't knock and, and so that just sh shows how how strong Runner is. You know, Runner he, he really he he, he, he like I said a lot of get that man credit though. No no you still got to get man credit. You still got to give Maydon a credit. Now he said you can't give him no credit. I mean you still you still can give him his credit, but it's certain. But yeah, I give him go up there. No 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 no. What I'm saying, I give him credit for the W. I give him credit for the W. As far as as far as it's not, it just shows. It just shows you what Brunner has. Like yeah, I said, yeah. shows you that Brunner really is strong. He, he's, he's physically strong. When he got dropped, he just like get dropped yeah. and quit. He yeah, got he, up he, and still he, was trying to win. Like he gotta, wasn't trying to survive. Get, trying to get, get, hey, I'm gonna get a man a credit. He, I mean, despite some, despite how he carry himself or whatever. I mean, I, I call it spin dude physically strong. Suspect Brown is no fluid. So man, people need to quit saying that. You know what I'm saying? That's my man, bro. Both of them fought the same guy. You know what I mean? Look at Floyd's performance and yeah. LeBron's performance against the same guy. So, you know, I feel, I feel like, I feel like, uh, I feel like, 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 like what he did was, was uh, Bucky. He should have he should have left the touring with the rapping oh, yeah. and all that partying and kicking it and then because it, it take it take a toll on, on rappers you know uh, doing that type of tour and, and uh, living that type of lifestyle and then he, he took that lifestyle and then got in the gym uh, yeah. you know kind of too soon and I, I think he should have waited for it. I think Broner would have had that in the bag. This is what I want to know though. Richard Schaefer says Adrian Broner Lucas Matisse would be fireworks. Tell me about that fight. I love that. Hey, I like, I like, I like that fight. Honestly, get honest I like, I, I like it, but I think, Kevin, like, I think basketball. me and Sean, we, we more so, we want to see Brian in there with somebody like Danny, uh, Randy Rios or somebody Danny like Garcia. that. We wanna, I, like I mean, any, we want to see him box somebody. Yeah, exactly. I want to see him box somebody. Hey, 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 I mean, what I'm saying, what I'm saying is, like any fight Adrian Brunner is in right now, at the level of his career, it's gonna be a good fight no matter what happens. But far as for what's best for his career, I think, I think, I don't think Batista is on um, something that's a good fight. Not, like, not right now. I like that fight. I like that. Fight. Nah, they never fight. Lamont, Lamont, Adrian, and never fight. You don't think they ever fight? They're like family. Not even if the money's right, huh? What about Adrian uh, Lucas? You know Adrian real well. What do you think of Lucas' last fight? He fought John Molina. What do you guys think of Matisse's fight? He got dropped, but he won a good hey, fight. Hey, hey, they show you John Molina is gonna be hard at 140. Boy, he cracked him. Yeah, man, that's just shit, man. I think, um, you know, that, that's that two warriors. You know, it was a great fight. I think it could be fight of the year. You know, one of him, you know, one of the fights, one of the potential fight of the fights of the year. You know, Matisse they showed that he can. Um, he can take a punch and he can give it. So, you know, with that, with that being said, you know, everybody got to, no, no matter who he gets in the ring, whether it's Bruno, Danny, John Malin, no matter who it is, you got to respect a guy like him. Also, too.